100 were squeezed into Fellows Park for the game, but there was no way of knowing early on quite what a demolition was to come. Birmingham seemed fairly comfortable through the first half. They just needed someone capable of finishing. Indeed, Steve Wigley had looked the best player before the break. Afterwards, well, there really was something to get worked up about. Graham Forbes started the collapse, rising like the mortgage rate for the first. Birmingham might as well have borrowed a white Walsall shirt and surrendered on block because two minutes later, Craig Shakespeare played his part with a dramatic controlled drive. And Birmingham were well and truly stitched up by the time Alex Taylor got the third. Alex Taylor! The Blues then really set in with Walsall's fourth. The deflection was fortunate but the Birmingham resistance had completely wilted. For the fifth, they were able to warp the ball in. Mark Rees, the substitute, gets the credit. Walsall are still unbeaten, but Birmingham City looked like they're in desperate need of some Olympic spirit.